Hello, I'm Mitchell Kaminsky, and welcome to the Beyond the Braves Weekly Recap Show. It's time for a quick recap in the week of Bradley Sports. After opening the 2019 season with a title at the Bradley Intercollegiate, senior Jake Hofford was honored as the Missouri Valley Male Cross Country Athlete of the Week on Tuesday for crossing the finish line in first place at Peoria's Detweiler Park. On Wednesday, Bradley soccer was forced to go to extra time yet again, marking the 10th time in its last 19 games fans have gotten more soccer than they paid for, dating back to last season. Unfortunately, all the experience in extra time did not help the Braves put the ball in the net as they ended in a scoreless draw against Loyola Chicago. Bradley was scheduled to play Valpo in the final game of September, but Mother Nature had other ideas as the game was canceled Sunday due to weather with the Braves trailing 1-0 in the 66th minute, and will now be replayed from its beginning Tuesday night, October 1st. On Friday, Bradley Volleyball opened Missouri Valley Conference play in a barn burner against Southern Illinois. Bradley had three individuals collect double-doubles. Sophomore Hannah Thompson paced the Braves with a season-best 18 kills and also added 24 digs for her 10th consecutive double-double. Fellow sophomore Rachel Pronger celebrated her birthday with 16 kills and 22 digs as she posted her fourth double-double of the year. In addition, junior Emma Rowley paced the Braves' defensive efforts with career highs of 10 assists and 28 digs for her first career double-double. Ultimately, the Braves would fall in five sets. The Braves would bounce back on Saturday afternoon, powering past Missouri State 3-1. Bradley's freshman middles, Rianne Bergman and Kerrigan Coggin, combined for 16 kills without an error on just 27 attacks, while sophomore Hannah Thompson added her 11th consecutive double-double. The victory was Bradley's third straight win in the series, with Missouri State to mark the first time the Braves have clinched three consecutive matches from the Bears. The Braves hit the road next week and will play their MVC road opener tonight at Indiana State. And finally, Bradley Golf looks to defend their title in the Zach Johnson Invitational today in Des Moines, Iowa. The Braves have won the Zach Johnson invite each of the last two years, 2016 and 2018, they have competed in Drake's Fall Tournament. Well, that's all we have for you this week. Until next time, Sco Braves!